A woman tells us she is disgusted to find out her private photos were stolen at a cell phone repair shop in Cleveland. Well, the employee is accused of sending the woman's nude pictures to himself. The victim speaking only to ABC 13's Brooke Taylor about how she says she caught him in the act, Brooke. Yeah, that woman was nervous to even sit down with us and speak anonymously because she says she's been getting a lot of hate and victim shaming online for even taking those private photos. But she says it's important to speak out in case this has happened to anyone else. The doors are open at Gadget Cure in Cleveland, while a young woman who wants to stay anonymous to protect her privacy is traumatized and shaken up ever since walking out of the store. Disgusted. Like, very, very disgusting. In February, she says she went to get her phone repaired. While waiting, she noticed something unusual on her Apple Watch. Messages being sent from her own phone to an unknown number before they were deleted. It's like 65 pictures, and I'm like, wow. So I go back and I go get my phone. I was like, oh my God, like, those are my photos. And I was really upset about it. She tells me she sent the pictures and videos to her boyfriend at the time and never meant for them to be seen by anyone else. And it just kind of hurts because who knows how many people he's done that to, what he did with the pictures. Cleveland police arrested the employee, 26 year old Jonathan Petroshansky, and charged him with invasive visual recording. The detective on the case told ABC 13 Petroshansky's brother owns the store. When the woman told the owner what happened, she says he offered her $500 not to speak to anyone and promised he'd fire the employee. She agreed and collected the cash. My family could really use the money right now, so I took it. And I probably wouldn't have signed an NDA in the first place if I knew that they were siblings. But the detective tells us Petroshansky was never even fired. That's why she's speaking only to ABC 13, fearing the store isn't taking the arrest seriously and worries there could be more victims. I feel like there's probably people he took more pictures of. Well, he took their pictures and they're probably like young. They could be under 18. And Petroshansky's bond was set at $20,000. He has been released from jail. We tried to walk inside that store and see if we could speak to him or the owner, but we were not given any information.